What's up guys, I'm here at Trap Bar Terry's place and we're gonna check out some of his paintings. We're gonna talk to him. He's one of the coolest artists I've ever met. He paints for a lot of celebrities. I don't know if he wants me to name them, but I love the creative process, so I'm really here to figure out what drives a guy like that and what makes him as good as he is. <laughs> Terry right when I moved to LA and from there uh, we became friends and I kind of saw what he was up to what he's been doing and it's really cool I wanted to share it with everyone else so actually Terry's an artist I want to leave it to you to kind of tell everyone what you do and uh, why you do it I've been painting since like first grade Chop art. and my basic goal with art is just trying to get people like me you know what I'm saying to be inspired to just do what they love and not work a nine-to-five you feel me so that's my basic, my whole ideology on what I do. So, so what are you doing right now? I'm um, working on a show, a Rick and Morty art show. I'm working on a Rick and Morty art show that's going to be in downtown LA and I think across the country as well. Why the why the cartoons? Is that where you draw your inspiration from? No, nah, but you know, generally cartoons make people happy. You feel me? Like if you. If you see a cartoon and you 30, it's gonna bring, it's gonna trigger a memory that's, you know what I'm saying, it's like from your childhood. So I like to do that. Run. So what's your dog's name? Madonna. Is Madonna well trained? Uh, a little bit, not really though. Have you ever why. got Madonna in the club? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <Definitely>. you did. <laughs> Couple and of them actually. When you get Madonna in the clubs, does she bring more or less girls your way? Way more. Way more. Yeah, way more. If you guys don't know, Terry and I did a Dalmatian swimwear shoot where we actually had Terry paint Dalmatian spots on the swimwear. I'll show you the video right here. Madonna's big debut actually, the first time she became a star and now she's too cool for me, she won't even look at me. So Tennessee period, it ain't no ain't no art scene period. Which is now, like over the, like the last two or three years, it's, it's gaining but it's like still no art scene. No money generated from it at all. So like out there I was going super hard. So when I got to LA, it was like a breeze, you know what I'm saying? Because I was already putting in the amount of work. So when I got here, I thought I had to work super hard, which, I mean, it's, it's still good, but with my work ethic back there, bringing it here, it was easy, super easy. It makes sense. So now he's killing it out here. He works with a number of clients. Are you allowed to tell us about any of your uh, private clients? That I just don't discuss clients, period. I think that's professional. I would agree. <laughs> it's always fun to try and get one out of you. Um, if you were stuck on a desert island and you were not allowed to drink water, what would be your second beverage that you chose to drink for the rest what? of your life? What kind of question is that? <laughs> <laughs> like, what? like, what kind of question is that? If you were an astronaut without a space suit, who would be the last person you thought of before you eventually combusted in the air? <laughs> 
<laughs> it's not funny. I don't know why I'm laughing. <laughs> That's really nice. You heard it here first. What should I link? TrapRotator.com. You guys should check out some of his prints. They're for sale, right? You can yes, buy them? Sir. So you can buy some of his prints down below if you click TrapArtTerry.com. 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 <laughs> I'm nothing but wasted air. So you wondering where I got my shoes. They're from Ansel Elgort. These are one of ones. Thank you, Ansel. If you guys have seen The Fault in Our Stars, he's a great actor. Thank you, buddy.